As we know, Xiaomi is working on its upcoming flagship smartphones Xiaomi Mix 5 series, and we have already seen leaks regarding its camera department. Now today, a new leak has provided a look at the display specifications of the Mix 5 and Mix 5 Pro. According to Xiaomi UI, the Xiaomi Mix 5 series would debut with premium display panel. To be specific, both models are tipped to feature 6.73-inch E5 AMOLED panels, with ULPS support for lower power consumption and LTPO 2.0 support. Supposedly, both phones will feature WQHD Plus displays, an upgrade on the Mi Mix Fa's Full HD Plus panel. Peak brightness is listed at 1500 nits, which is about typical for E5 panels. The Xiaomi Mix 5 series will continue with the Mi Mix Fa's under display selfie camera, though we expect the implementation of the technology to be better this time. According to earlier leaks, the Mix 5 and Mix 5 Pro are likely to differ in two departments, namely camera sensors and camera processor. The report states that the second generation Surge C2 ISP, or the existing Surge C1, could be made available on the Mix 5 Pro. It further states that the Mix 5 might feature the Surge C1 chip. At present, there are no details available on the features of the Surge C2. Talking about the camera department, the Xiaomi Mix 5 and Mix 5 Pro is expected to have a 48 megapixel front facing camera. The Mix 5's rear camera setup will have an OIS enabled 50 megapixel main sensor with 8192 by 6144 pixels resolution, a 48 megapixel ultra wide lens, and a 48 megapixel camera with 2x optical zoom. On the other side, the Mix 5 Pro will have an OIS-ready 50-megapixel primary sensor with 8192 by 6144 pixels resolution, a 48-megapixel ultra-wide lens, and an OIS-assisted 48-megapixel lens with 5x optical zoom. The resolution of 8192 by 6144 pixels is associated with 50 megapixel Sony sensors, such as IMX 766 and IMX 707. Hence, the Mix 5 and Mix 5 Pro models may come equipped with either of these camera sensors. It's unknown when the Xiaomi Mix 5 series will make its debut but there is a strong indication of the phones being Xiaomi's range leading releases for the year. So guys that's pretty much we have here for now, we would love to know your thoughts on this. Hope you enjoyed the video and found it informative, and if you did, hit the like button and stay subscribed for more.